These are some of the supplies you'll need to make the shark mask. A paper plate, large, small, or medium, it doesn't matter. Blue paint, black paint, a napkin, a paintbrush, some circle you can trace. I'm gonna use tape, a glue stick, scissors, and a pen or pencil. Let's get started. What you're going to do is separate the paper plate into two. You're gonna be painting one side black and one side blue. So let's do that right Here's now. about halfway. I didn't measure, I just eyed it. Now we're gonna take the black paint and the top of the paper plate is gonna be all I painted black. the top of the paper plate black and now I'm gonna paint the bottom section blue. I painted the bottom of the plate blue and now I'm gonna let the plate dry. Just about dry. Now we're gonna position this tape on the plate and then we're going to trace out the eyes so we can cut them out. So I've got the eyes marked out so I can cut them. You're gonna take the white piece of paper and you're gonna mark off two inches. And then we're gonna cut it out and make a two inch strip. These are going to be our shark's teeth. We're just going to make triangles for shark teeth. And then we're going to cut them out. So I have the eye holes cut, you can see right here. And I have the teeth cut. And I'm just going to line the teeth up along the edge of the black. You can make them over. You can make them overlap a little bit, like a real shark. That looks good. Okay, let's glue them on. Jeff is making two fins. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, I folded this piece of black construction paper over and then I'm gonna fold it again and then I'm gonna make two triangles. Two triangles like this. And then cut them I out. Cut out the fins and just like real sharks, I put two on the bottom and one on the top and they're just the triangles that I showed you. So he's finished and the only thing now is how to attach him or to hold him in front of your face and one way of doing that is you can punch holes with a hole punch in the side and connect a string or you can get a craft stick. If you do not have a craft stick that you can tape on the bottom here. You can also use a piece of scrap cardboard and just fold it so that it's long and skinny and then tape and put right here. So I hope that you enjoyed this shark mask project. Thank you for viewing.